Hey everyone, I hope you guys are doing good. I am Priya with another video for you guys. I know it's been long since I made a video. I think the last video that I made was on the Valentine's Day and after that I've been going through a lot lately which is why I've not been able to make a vlog but I'm happy that today I had the courage and it took me a lot to start making a vlog today. I exactly cannot express what I've been going through lately is because uh, I'm not allowed to and there are certain things I cannot say on social media which is why uh, I'm just gonna keep silent but I, I want to make a small request to all of you if you guys can just uh, remember me in your prayers just ask God to to take care of things that are going bad in my life I'm sorry a lot of people have told me you should open up you should tell your problems to people around you but the, it's just the kind of person I am I like to keep things inside especially the bad things I like positivity, I like spreading positivity, I like talking about good stuff but when something negative happens I like to keep it all inside because I'd rather let the pain destroy me than everyone else around. So yeah this is just how I am heading to uh, Yas Mall with uh, Sid and we are going to show you what we are going to eat in the mall. I am almost ready and so is Sid. But I am super and hungry and starving you know I have not eaten anything since morning and I am telling yeah. you yeah, let's go out and eat. Yeah, and as usual. I'm craving for some Indian food. <laughs> so we are planning to eat on Asha's. It's a restaurant by Asha's. It's all over UAE. Let's get on with it. Uh, this is our new apartment. Guys. Oh yes, yeah, guys. This is our new apartment, but we have still not decorated it. But hopefully we're gonna do it soon. Yes, and once yes. it's decorated, I will make a vlog on it. Yeah. yeah. But for now, it's a bit messy because things are all over the place. The view is really good, actually. You can see the Yas Island. Now I'm not going to show them anything right now. I need to make a separate vlog on that. So you guys have to stay tuned for that vlog. But anyway, right now, let's head to Yas Mall. 24 degrees in Abu Dhabi. It's nice. The weather is pleasant. We can go out have some fun. That's our academy over there. Formula One race takes place. We just parked the car and we are heading right inside the mall. My vlog is now. He's not letting the boss. I'm the boss boy. <laughs> he's not letting me. He's not the boss girl, I'm the boss boy. <laughs> Light. The lift, it has camera out there so you guys don't do anything. What do you mean don't do anything? Like nothing goes wrong. Safe, you know Abu Dhabi is a safe country. Abu Dhabi is very very safe. It is yeah, small so they have a lot of paintings outside as you can see over here. It's on display. If you guys like anything you can always pick it up and you can buy. They're okay. trying to promote some local designs. Really. All abayas over here that uh, local people wear so you can if you like something it's also made by local designers over here if you like anything that you can just pick it up you can see your size you can ask them about the price and they will let you know it's not cheap look at this dress it's, it's like 1000 dirhams 1000 dirhams it's, I think that that's quite a lot it's quite expensive but then if you like something if you're one-time visitor here tourist here and if you want to take home any souvenir like you know local costume you can always pick it up from here anyway we are heading to the restaurant to eat this restaurant just behind us it's a very new restaurant i think less than a month we kind of changed our mind and we decided to try out this new place we're gonna try out food here japanese cuisine which i really love and of course we love as well basically we have eaten proper japanese food when we go to japan and all you know but still we do crave when we are here and it's yeah. been long for me i've not been to japan yeah me too so i want to have some miso soup sushi and let's see what's sushi. there in the menu you're supposed to go to asha's which is but the indian restaurant but it's okay we can go over there next time how about just trying some japanese food because sushi is love <laughs> so let's go let's try japanese in gatsu uh, in abu dhabi it looks nice and comfy, you know. 
as I said, it's a super new restaurant, so I'm excited to try out the food here. February 20th, which is about like what, 15 days ago. We just got ourselves the menu, hot towels. <laughs> Just sparkling water with lemon. Have a tea, the matcha. Drinking yes. water. Yeah. Excited? Excited, yes, to try the new food. What is this that you are drinking? This is matcha green tea, and usually Japanese they say when you drink tea, you need to hold it like this. Then you drink like this. It looks like dynamite stream actually, and it's a lot of food. I will give out of 10, 7. What is yours? Ready? Yes, please. This is similar to Bibimpa. Yeah, this is Japanese. Yeah, this is Japanese Bibimpa. Yeah, this Japanese bibimpa. <laughs> Light making romantic. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I think sun is down now. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Smells good though. This I'll give nine. Because it's very fresh and the quality of the meat it's very tender so it's a premium meat i think so they have used it that's why it's quite expensive but it's nice that's sushi oh my gosh yes <laughs> We got some wasabi. I'm thinking to dip this wasabi in the soy sauce. So let's have some fried vegetables and shrimps. Uh huh. How's it? Look, to cook tempura is the most easiest. I was just telling the waiter, you know, the only thing missing is the beer because. It tastes good with beer and usually in Abu Dhabi, not the restaurants in the mall, they cannot have alcohol license. So you need to go with tea or some soft drinks, whatever you choose. Or sparkling water. Look at our happy faces now. <laughs> food. What else do you want in life? A beautiful girlfriend? Aww. <laughs> I was very happy with uh, the service especially. Yeah, so 400. Around 400 dirhams yes. for, um, for the entire course. But we had a lot of food. so. Yeah, I would not be complaining anyway. Outside a makeup forever shop, happiness is when you buy yourself makeup. Foundation and control palette. Yes, thank you very much. Bought myself some compact powder. The lady was telling me to go for a lighter shade, and I was like, nope. I want the one which is my own skin color so yeah I got what I wanted it's apparently the one that I was recommended it's the HD Pro from Makeup Forever that was out of stock and they gave me a new one it's better apparently because it has a matte finish so I got that one because it's evening now we are heading to our favorite place to have tea enjoy the evening chat with me new color okay it's like this Make a forever matte velvet skin in case the lady is watching me when I try this out. I have never used a compact powder from, from Make Up Forever. It's my first time. That side over there is the Ferrari world. Yeah. It's on the other side. Maybe I'll make a vlog one day over there. That's Ferrari world for you and right opposite is that one is the Yas Water World. Just here to fill petrol. I feel much better 
than what I was feeling in the past one week. I get my energy back and I can make more vlogs for all of you. I'm not as active and as, or I can say proactive like the other YouTube vloggers. I'm a bit slow. I take my own time. I am still new to this YouTube world. To get uh, social and to adapt to this YouTube culture, it will take me some time because honestly, I am an introvert and I don't share about my life or my personal stuff with anyone unless I feel it's really neat. YouTube has really helped me to come out of my shell and speak up, open up about my life, about my decisions, about the things I do. It has helped me a lot. So I'm not only the one who is doing a lot for you guys, you guys are doing a lot for me as well. I read all the comments, I read all the messages that I get and truly, truly, truly I am thankful to all of you because it inspires me and helps me personally uh, in a lot of ways that I can't even tell you guys. It, it helps me to be more open, to be more understanding, more patient, to force myself to be happy even at the times when I'm a bit down like especially these two weeks when I was not feeling good feeling low but the comments were coming in or the messages were coming in to me like please make YouTube vlogs uh, where are you and everything so it made me feel like there are people who are there for me who who, who, who are willing to listen to me that helped me to move on and make a vlog so it's a good thing yeah, Aki is here Good old Jackie Bally Ho! Quite a Ho! Anyway, we are having our tea Jack and we are. Bally Ho! Bally Ho! See this in the gunny Bally Ho! Are you done? Anyway, guys, we are drinking our tea and heading back home. I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, video. Stay tuned for more vlogs. I hope I can make more vlogs this week. Thank you so much for sticking by and still taking out time to watch my videos. I really appreciate it. Uh, till then, this is Priya saying bye to you guys and I will see you soon in my next vlog and lots of love. God bless you all.